Well, hi guys, and welcome back to Alcan ADV. And yes, I did ride my motorcycle. I haven't been doing a whole lot, but uh, in a little plowing, a little working on the bikes, and uh, here's a little clip from uh, some of the stuff I just did to the DR. So I'm here in the shop doing a little uh, maintenance and repair work on the DR, and uh, I want to show you guys what was going on. So I had a faulty fuel pet cock started up uh, last fall. Here it is, this is the, this is the old one. Uh, it's a vacuum pet cock. And so it started leaking gas down into the engine. And I didn't catch it for long enough to where it flooded the engine by the time I caught it. So I couldn't start it. So it sat all winter uh, that way. And I got a new pet cock for it. I just now put it on. Ah, there it is. And it's a manual pet cock, so it only has the, the one line going down. It doesn't have the vacuum line back in the back. And uh, we'll see how that works waiting on the battery to charge right now so this bike holds one quart of oil almost exactly if you uh, change it and replace the filter as well it'll take just a little over a quart but just changing the oil you put one quart in so uh, as a little bit of a reference I drained what was in the engine and that's some of it down there once I drained it I uh, and and replaced the oil I had the empty oil bottle over here one of those and uh, so I took a quart out of this and put it in there this is how much too much I had and you can see how liquid it is so it's oil and gas and there's definitely over a quart there I'm not sure how much but it's more than a quart so uh, it didn't just dilute the oil it uh, <laughs> it put way too much in this I don't I can't imagine but I bet this whole thing was full so I got that straightened out, and I did ride it a little bit, uh, not much. Mostly I've been riding my snow machine around, but, uh, you know, no better way to do some social distancing, right? Unless you're flying, which I just did today, and that'll be the last day for a little while, so I was happy to get it. So this wasn't a real structured flight, just kind of out for fun, and uh, this is flying down the bluff, down the beach, uh, along the Cook Inlet, out toward Kasilov, so... That's, that was fun, a lot of fun. And the rest of what you see here is just odd shots of here and there around the Kenai Peninsula here. So enjoy the rest of it and stay safe, you guys. We'll catch you next week.